Hey guys, we're back with Steven Universe and this time it's Arcade Mania. So what did you think of this one? Why do you keep asking me what I think of the episode? You know what I think of the episode. Stuff happened, I get tired of watching this show, occasionally something funny happens, the end. Well, I just summed up every review, past, present and future. Well this one was a little different. I liked that they started right in the action they were already on a mission. They did that last time! They did? Yeah, they started in the desert and there's a lion. Oh, yeah. So nice try. <laughs> well, this one was, um, this one told us more about Garnet because it finally showed us what she looks like without her glasses. That's a good point. I completely forgot she was wearing glasses. <laughs> what, did you think she just had no eyes and it's had a white part no, of her it's face? it's just something you don't think about. True. And then a lot of people get a bit of a shock when they see that she has three eyes. Yeah, before that I was just going to call her the crow gunk of this show because she just stands there doing nothing but occasionally when she does stuff she's amazing. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. But um, when they tried to fight the little guys without Garnet it was showing that they were lost without her. And... That thing that I've always been talking about foreshadowing, they finally talked about it a little, but Pearl brushed it off as just being heightened perception. But that's just what they're going to call it for now, because I don't think they want to explain it to Stephen. Oh, well, it's a third eye. It's been in lots of mythology. It usually means you're psychic or something along those lines. Yeah, something like that. But I see what you mean when you say not much happens. I agree. It's hard to talk about the episodes much. It's ten minutes. They start in the action. They go to the arcade. We get some jokes. Some crap happens. We get some more jokes. Some more crap happens. We learn she's got a third eye. And we're done. <laughs> That's basically it, yeah. Yeah, season one episodes are very easy to summarise. Yeah, we already Whereas went through this. there are later episodes when a lot happens. Like I said, I'm getting tired of reviewing Steven Universe. It's not suited for reviews when every episode is the same. True. I've seen some people um, review an entire season at once. Well, that would make sense. There would be nothing to talk about in season one. True. Season one doesn't have much until near the end. Good. Maybe next time we can review something different. I'll think about it. Good. At least that'll keep it different. But the next episode of Steven Universe is one I am excited for, which is Giant Woman. You said that about this episode! Yeah, but the next one's even better. Oh, for goodness sake. But for now, we still have to rate this one. We do? Yes. Fine, what's your rating? Mm, 6.5? I... Yes, that's generous. I'm gonna give it a five point five. There were some inter there were some or there were some moments that had me interested. Not interested, but there were some good jokes here and there. But last episode probably had the better humor. Or even Oh, uh, last episode had good humor and this. The episode blew it together, I've completely forgotten most of the episodes already. I can't even compare it to previous episodes to remember what I loved and didn't love. Mm-hmm. Yeah, most of the best humour comes from Amethyst. All her little one-lines, well, like... It's, it's either one-lines or they use her as the background joke character. Yeah, it's mostly just lines like, I swallowed a rock. I'm it's... a winner airplane! Exactly! This show knows how to do one-liners. <laughs> yeah, definitely. They That's know all this show. That's all this show is, is... One-liners and background jokes, and that's about it. Well, and hang it... on. The conversation about the giant foot wasn't one line. It was it was a flowing conversation of funny. Yeah, but that's how you continue a random joke. Yeah. They, they did that well, I'll admit. Exactly. I forgot about that scene. <laughs> I, I never forget that scene. That's one of my favourite scenes of season one. Slam your face in the plate. <laughs> <laughs> but... See, that's the point. All we can think about is random jokes. That's the problem with a show. It's not a show. It's a collection of memes. That you, that's all you care about. No wonder people care about this show. Well, for now. Well, for now, I'm bored of reviewing Steven. It's a 5.5 for me, and I'm being generous. Mm. Humor can only get you so far. Yeah, I guess so. 
Well, next time is less humour and more... I don't know what to call it, but I like it. Oh, great. You've already made me not excited for the next episode. And besides, why should I trust your opinion? You say you love an episode, that means I'm probably going to hate it. After all, you said you hated the Frybo episode, and that's probably still my favourite. Okay, well, we'll see. We'll see. Apparently we will see next time.